Well, Daddy, you'll never, never, never guess who's arrived at Lock Willow. Master Jervy. And such a nice time we're having. At least I am. And I think he is too. He's been here ten days and doesn't show any signs of leaving. He still looks like a true Pendleton, but he isn't in the least. He's just as simple and unaffected and sweet as can be. Such a lot of adventures we're having. We've explored the country. For miles and miles. And I've learned to fish. With funny little flies. Made of feathers and twine. And shoot with a revolver. And paddle a canoe. And ride on horseback. On Sunday, we scandalize the Semples by skipping church. We climb Sky Hill instead. We stayed at the top for the sunset and built a fire in some rocks and cooked our supper. Then we came down by moonlight. It was so beautiful. We laughed and joked and talked the whole way. He's read all the books I've ever read and lots of others besides. I've discovered the secret of happiness is not to run too fast. I've discovered the secret of happiness is not to mourn the past. Nothing of any importance can last. I imagine the secret of happiness was the art of compromise. But I've discovered the secret of happiness is looking in her eyes. Happiness comes as a total surprise. And the secret, the secret of happiness is living in the now. Living in the time it takes to blink, I think. Is how we're meant to be living. I've discovered the secret of happiness is all the stars that shine. But I've discovered the secret of happiness is something more divine. That her happiness is more precious than mine. And the secret. The secret of happiness is the secret of happiness is clear. The secret of happiness is clear. The secret of happiness.